Yeah, um, I think it was obviously I didn't get offered a contract uh, another year at TNS, and obviously when we were in college and stuff, we were planning. I well, I planned to either go to America or come to Cardiff Met, and um, obviously with all the virus stuff and all that, America didn't go through. So obviously my decision was made to come down to Cardiff Met. And you're studying here as well, right? Yeah, uh, sports coaching. Yeah. How do you think that studying here sort of helps to improve your game? Yeah, I think. Um, I think obviously being around the lads a lot, obviously being on campus and stuff. Um, obviously, I'm in the same course as uh, another lad, Jack Davis, so that's a um, bit better and helps you obviously fit in a fit in a bit more maybe. Um, but yeah, it's help it's helping a lot and obviously seeing how a different style of coaching coming here and obviously I can go away then and um, discover if. If I want to take that coaching style myself, how has it been adapted to this new environment, new coaches, new teammates? Have you been settling in well? Yeah, I've, yeah. Um, obviously, I think I can't remember when we started pre-season, but it's been a long, long time now. Um, obviously, travelling down back and too, and uh, luckily enough, I knew um, a couple of boys out here already, so that helped uh, fit in as well a lot. And yeah, yeah, it's it's been it's been good. It has been good. Settled in well. Uh, so we've seen before that you played in Europe with your previous club. Uh, how was that experience for you, and how do you think that could help you with Cardiff Met? Is it something you think you could do again with Cardiff Met? Yeah, well, obviously that's the aim to play European football. Obviously, being in the Welsh Prem, you get that chance. Um, obviously, going out with TNS, oh, it was a great experience. You know, playing playing with the fans and stuff, um, big crowds and all that. So yeah, it was good, and that's the aim here. Hopefully, to get into Europe and as they've done before. Uh, so the new lockdowns being announced, you won't be able to play any games for the next two weeks. Um, obviously, the team's had a poor run of form recently, but just started turning around on the weekend. Yeah. Um, do you see this as sort of a nice chance to reset as a team, or would you rather, with the team, rather be getting straight back into matches, keeping this momentum going? Yeah. Not um, around? Well, obviously, you could say we had poor run of form. Um, game, a couple of games went against us. Um, the College Key game, for example, um, they took nicked it at the end. Um, mm. But as I said, obviously, the big win on the weekend, and you, were, we came into tra training raring not knowing what was going to happen and then obviously it's been cut short but I think obviously it's a chance for the boys to reach out to the batteries and stuff. Previous placed Wales in the under 18 squad, uh, a few of the other your teammates have played in Wales C. Is this something you spoke to them about, about breaking into the team? Is this an aspiration for you? Um, no, I think obviously my first aim is just obviously break into this side. It's a tough, tough side to break into but that's the aim and then hopefully go from there but obviously you've got to set your standards high and that will be the plan in the future maybe.